Welcome back to Rags to Riches in Sulani Part 3. When we left our girl, she was just leaving the Spice Festival, ready to go home and get some sleep. Mmm, I wish I could go back to sleep. Her garden is really coming together. Check that out. Her pineapples are ready, although she does have a few weeds and some bugs, but we'll take care of that. But from the Spice Festival, she got like a whole bunch of different plants. So she's putting those in so she'll have an even bigger and more useful garden. Make it even more. She is making herself a garden salad. Super crunchy, light, delicious, healthy, full of vegetables, and doesn't need it here. For a stove. Our girl is filthy and stinky! Oh boy! So she headed over to the waterfall. and decided to go cry in the waterfall <laughs> while she bathed. I mean, I feel a little called out right now, but okay. She needed some socialization, so she tried to make friends with the locals, but then she got invited to go to the uh, lab. <laughs> There was a whole open mic thing going on. And you see that gentleman with the darker skin and the man bun? He'll be important soon. She's go here and try her best to quote unquote sing. I think she needs a little bit more practice, don't you? But this gentleman over here is still watching her. He has caught her eye. Do you think? Maybe? I don't know. But they spent all night chatting, so I don't know. Maybe he sees something in her. Far off, Amy. Sure. I am blue of Gucci Beach. What a fish, Usha. Back home, she goes to water her plants and finishes a little bit of last minute stuff that she didn't get a chance to get to earlier that day. A little bit of weeding. She's still on a high from the night meeting that man, singing, hanging out, being social. Now she's trying her hand at knitting. While she was in the city, she grabbed herself a new knitting kit. She's never knit before, but the kit came with some great instructions. So she figured she'd try her hand on it. And if she gets any good, maybe she can sell her stuff on Plopsy and make a little bit extra cash. I don't know. She'd like to get out of the tin can as soon as possible. Any way to make money is a good way to make money. Looks like she's starting to get the hang of it now. She's so excited looking back. She made a cute little yes. hat. Oh. Oh. 
doesn't know whether she's excited about the hat or in grown mode because she's still living in a tin can. But the next morning, her garden is chock full of fruits and veggies and herbs ready to be sold. Look at that. Look how good she's doing. refrigerator books. We love a good refrigerator book. I don't know, that's the only place where we had to put it at the time. Tending her garden, making sure everything is watered and well kept so that her plants will continue to produce. So now we also got her a fishing basket. So she put some bait in that. Now she's going to go out for a bit of a swim and clean up the beach a little bit and seeing what she can find. A few frogs. And she's going to head up to the volcano. There's some flaming ash she's trying to put out. But she found some smoldering ash and decided to pick that up instead. Now she's heading on over here to this bathroom because there's a coconut tree she's been waiting on and it was ready to harvest so she grabbed some of that. Now she's heading on back to her little tin can on the beach. Checking out her goods, seeing what she has, breeding some frogs. Now she's gonna go fishing. Her fishing has improved. She still didn't catch a whole lot this time. She did get a fish, however. Not a very big one, but it was something. Ooh, Salim's coming to visit. Hello, Salim. How are you doing? Look at him, he's feeling saucy. Hey, I'm just trying to make my money, you know, doing my thing. I have side hustles for my side hustles. And, mm. He's like, mm, no, maybe not. I'm not into you like that. Oh, but why? I'm such a sunny personality. And then he changes his mind. He's like, you know what? You're kind of right. She's gonna go 
save their garden. She's really getting into it. She's really liking it. It's very relaxing and calming to her. And now she's taking up painting. We were able to purchase an easel for her. It's almost like she's painted before. Look, she's making a watermelon painting with some apples and stuff. Or are those cherries? I don't know. But she's gotten pretty good. I can't remember what skills she came with when I made her. But she had like level two or three painting skill or something. I did the story questions first and then I edited her appearance. Doing some gardening that morning after she finished painting. The tarot is ready to go. We're still waiting on the cow plant though, but it's nice to be able to bring in some regular cash. You can't go wrong with a little swim in the morning. It was a beautiful day, so why not? Good for her in body and psyche. So sure, why not? Let's go for it. Ooh, she sold a pair of socks. And look, we actually get to make her a proper room with walls and a door. I know. I'm excited. I know it's just a little bedroom, but it's something. She's never had a whole room to herself before. She was living in a roof with a door in it. Which is a great way to start doing rags to riches, but... You know, nothing beats having your own room. Your own four walls. Even if it's not very big to start with but we're getting somewhere. I'm quite proud of her. She's working really hard. She's talking to her plants, doing a little research. She figured the best way to make a better garden that produces more and produces higher quality stuff is to do a little research, learning about her plants. Now she's in her very own room for the first time, knitting. It's comfortable, it's warm. Oh, now there isn't yes. much in the way of cash to decorate that with, you were lucky 21 simoleons after all the rearranging. But we'll get there, I promise. Let's start someplace. Four walls of your own is better than no walls at all. Decoration can come like a little gardening. Spraying those bugs that keep getting into those plants. Holy crap. I swear, every single day she was out to garden, there were some bugs. Really annoying. It was beautiful outside to have a little breakfast and now we're doing a little bit of upgrading since that since she has made some money from the gardening so I'm switching out her bed I gave her a bee box because they can give you honey and wax I do want her to get started on candle making as well so until we can afford a candle making table we're just gonna like hoard the wax but solve honey I put one of her plant hanging things in the room because it's cute it's decorative also plants and she's finally sleeping in her very own room. It's beautiful. It's actually kind of cute for a super small room. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate your company. You are amazing. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, rate, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one. Be well, happy, and peaceful. Bye, everyone.